Healthy Living with Miller, proudly sponsored by Paradise Beverages, TSD Barocco, and Trophy House, and proudly supported by Laguna Hotel. that you continuously join us to learn more about getting fit and healthy. My name is Mila. And my name is Miro. Last week, we have discussed and show you the combination of this exercise, the upper body and the lower body, including stretching. Yes, and also we stress more importantly on keeping your body well hydrated. That's by drinking a lot of water. Fiji water from Paradise Food. That is great for you. Now, we yes. also been joined by our awesome Chef James, who prepared a wonderful nutritional quick and easy meal that is great for our budget and also for the family. Yes, in which he will be joining us again later on in the show over at the grill with another budget friendly and nutritional meal. Now, this week's show is to focus on weight loss. We've chosen this topic because a lot of main health issues that many of our Papua New Guineans are facing on this day of um, age and mostly related to being excessively overweight. Demographically, PNG has a high rate mm. of obesity that links with the leading health problem like high blood pressure, pressure yes. and diabetes, diabetes and also uh, stress yes. and uh, heart disease. Yes, and in addition, Obese people, they will experience or they will get easily tired. They will experience uh, problems with their breathing. You will notice that they will have limited body movements and also obese people, they will get injured easily. That is true. Yes. That is the reason why we are here, our Healthy Living yes. with Mila, yeah. are here to reach our PNG people. people for them, them to be awake that being obese yes. is not yeah. really okay. healthy. Obesity also is a cause of being inactive or you will notice that you are non-productive at work or at home. And how can we help our people on how they can live a healthy life? Your question is yes. how we can fight obesity, obesity yes. or control obesity. Yeah, that's right. Number one is you have to have a complete balanced nutrition meals. That's including your carbohydrates, your protein, your fats. And you should have to eat at least every three to four hours. Why? Because you have to limit the portion of the food that you're eating. You only have the portion of the food that your body only needs yes. for energy. And also avoid eating um, sugary Your food, food like white bread and all those Lots things things. and the drinks especially yes okay uh, avoid eating simple carbohydrates number one is ice cream milk chocolate mm. white bread cookies biscuits that is the thing when we we don't plan our meals whatever that is easy to get that is what we, we put, put in, in our mouth. mouth and mostly are the sweetest one the yes. processed food and also we have to be active do exercise we get out 15 minutes to get out from the house and come back for 15 minutes breeze walk that doesn't even like corrupt the whole of our time for the whole day and the most important is a night sleep yes 
night sleep, it will help to grow your damaged cells, the damaged tissue, and everything. It is, it compensates whatever we do into our body. Sleeping is number one to be active for the next day activities. After the break, we will join our guest chef who has been prepping up to cook a delicious chicken kebab. Stay with us as we go for the short messages. We will see you on the other side. fantastic guest chef James Morton. James is going to prepare us another healthy, well-balanced food that is affordable and for sure you will enjoy it. We welcome Chef Morton. Thank Hi you. James. Hi. How are Th you? Very well. Thanks Excellent. for having me back on the show, Mila. Yeah. <laughs> and also James, I would like you to mention, to tell to our viewers what um, ingredients and also the food, the menu that you have prepared for us today. Well, today we're going to prepare a spicy chicken skewer with uh, rice and a flatbread. And we're using a wide selection of uh, beautiful spices from Paradise Foods. Wow, Paradise Food. If you run out of your spices, paradise food, all the spices there are all uh, produced here in Papua New Guinea. It is also cultivated from Papua New Guinea. So for sure, it is a pure spices. Yes, now you can start showing our viewers okay. all the spices that you are going to do and start cooking. <laughs> okay, so uh, today we're using some uh beautiful chicken breast from TST supermarkets. We've got some uh, fresh vegetables, um, yogurt. I've That's got, all from uh, TST yep. supermarket. Now I've got a uh, tomato sauce here. It's uh, a basic pasta sauce like a pom pomodoro. Oh, okay. Um, some uh, minced uh, garlic, ginger. We've got um, coriander, garam masala, paprika and turmeric. Wow. Some salt and pepper. So for our marinade, I'm just yes. going to put in a little bit of garlic. And ginger. A little bit of ginger. Ginger is good for you for respiratory tract infection, especially if you are suffering from bronchitis. And that is the paprika? Yep. Yes. And a bit of turmeric. And the turmeric. Turmeric is called as a holy spices available at TST supermarket and also distributed by Paradise Spices. So there's our beautiful spice mix. Yes. We're going to add some... Smells good now. Ah, we're going to add some natural yogurt to that. And yogurt is a probiotic that is good for your digestive system. There's our tomato sauce and I've put salt and pepper in of course. You okay. should put salt and pepper in everything you're making. That's wonderful. The peppercorn that um, James used, he cracked it with mortar and pestle. That is all uh, coming from the paradise food, and that is all cultivated and produced here in Papua New Guinea. Now, what James is doing... I'll put in my chicken breast. Yes. And I'm going to wow. mix that right up. Oh, I can smell the spices. So that's our basic... Uh, chicken in the marinade. Okay. Now, obviously with chicken and, and any meats, if you're mar marinating it, the longer you leave it in the marinade, the more flavour is going to be absorbed by the meat. So, this could be prepared the day before, left in the okay. fridge in the marinade. These are the bamboo skewers and yes. I am soaking them in water. And why is that? Uh, if you're cooking uh, bamboo skewers with any kind of meat on a hot plate or a char grill, it will burn. It will burn. Yes. So if you soak them in water beforehand, it stops them burning and ah, you're left with the stick. Wow, that 
Take note of that, viewers. <laughs> That's a great tip from our chef, James. So basically, once we've got our marinade and our chicken, obviously, again, the, the longer you marinate it, the better it's going to taste. We can start putting our skewers together. Okay. And you just want to mix and match that with um, any vegetables you can get like, from TST like or lo local vegetables yes. from the market. Like zucchini and... and um, any yeah. vegetable you like. Look at that. That looks really good. And it really looks yummy. <laughs> <laughs> Getting hungry. That's our first skewer done. That looks awesome. Have a look at this. So, what's the next, Jane? Well, the next step is to uh, cook those up, and we'll serve them with some. Uh, we'll serve them with rice and a nice flat bread, a roti bread. Perfect. Now we are going to follow um, Chef James where he is going to cook it. So here we are over at the hot plate, Mila. This is where we're yes. going to cook it up. <laughs> it looks really big, hot plate. <laughs> So you're putting the olive oil? Yeah, a little bit of oil on there so that yes. stick. I'm just going to place these on and grill them. You could do them on a char grill. And we're just going to cook these uh, a nice medium heat. Yep. And this should take five or six minutes to cook through. And then we'll serve Perfect. them up with some hot rice and Egg. some flatbread. Well, if you're cooking meat, you really want to start it on a high heat so that you sear it oh, and trap okay. all the juices and flavours inside the meat. If you stew it, it, all that goodness is coming out. Okay. looks enticing. It really smells so good. Yeah, it does have a great smell to it. Now, yes. I've just got a couple of cups of um, hot, cooked hot yes. rice here. Yes. Which we'll use which is to... the right amount for your carbohydrates when you are preparing your food. One cup of rice per meal is just right for the body's energy, to provide energy to the body. And that is, Got what some. do you call that? Well, that's a roti bread. Roti bread. That is a bread. It's an Indian flat bread. That's right. That's right. And then we've got our beautiful skewers. Wow. Bit of, bit of garnish to make it look pretty. Okay. And there you go. There Barbecue you go. Barbecue chicken skewers. Very easy to prepare, very fast to cook, and be, can be cooked with very simple uh, cooking facilities. Chef James. Thank you very much again for this wonderful, affordable, and yummy meal that you have prepared. My pleasure. I'm very, very proud to have the Royal Papua Yacht Club, Chef James Martin. Stay tuned for the fitness and being active and also the helpful tips about drinking water. Welcome back. We'll join Mila on the fitness set shortly. But first, our health tip of the week. Our body requires proper nutrients to help detox body fat molecules to help us lose body weight and body fat. For today, we recommend lemon turmeric drink, which contains several ingredients that help us lose weight. They are citric acid, curcumin, and vitamin C, which lemon turmeric drink may help to burn body fat cleanse the digestive system, it heals body inflammation, especially muscle inflammation after exercises. You need a cup of crushed ginger, two tablespoons of cinnamon, half a cup of lemon, and also a quarter cup of honey. Now you put it all together, with six pieces of lemon grass root. It should be crushed. A 
a liter of water and then you start boiling it. Once that it started boiling, bring down the fire and simmer it for at least five to 10 seconds. Now, Magnus Health drink. This is a lemon juice with apple cider vinegar, turmeric, maple syrup, and warm water, or the ginger tea that you've just prepared. Now, lemon juice is a source of vitamin C, which also reduces hunger craving, good for weight loss. Apple cider vinegar, an apple is a good source of pectin, makes you fuller and content. The cider, a source of citric acid that stimulates digestion and reduces the amount of fat remains in the digestive tract. Now, turmeric, source of curcumin, a powerful medicinal compound traditionally used by Chinese and Indians. A potent anti-inflammatory for rheumatoid arthritis and may improve kidney function for those with kidney inflammation. The two tablespoon maple syrup is optional if you just want to have a little sweet taste. Remember one lemon juice, two teaspoon apple cider vinegar, one teaspoon turmeric into 300 ml warm water. Mix all ingredients thoroughly, drink 100 ml three times a day before meals. Now, you can look up this recipe on our website if you didn't get a chance to scribble it down or write it down. Now, in our last two segments, we demonstrated to you or showed you basic exercise movements. They are squat, lunges, push exercise, pull exercise, and body rotation. We also demonstrate you on how you can execute them properly, the right body form, and we also showed you on how you can breathe in and breathe out properly while doing these exercises. Let's get into physical. We're going to show you the floor aerobic exercise. What is this floor aerobic exercise? We combine the upper body and the lower body that we did three weeks for the last three weeks. And this type of exercise, it targets the lungs, the hearts, and the muscles. Now, this time we are going to show you three fitness levels, which is the beginner, that will be done by Tyra Pope. The intermediate level will be done by Tracy Kiriwo, and the advanced is, will be performed by Kamuna Voy. They're all my Magnus team who will join us and we're going to show you the first thing is we're going to do a 10 minutes warm up and that 10 minutes warm up is marching march it up 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 time for your stretching one leg to the front and press your hips down. What we're targeting here is your hamstring and your calves and your butt. Okay, you inhale, exhale. Now release it up, back to position. One leg on the side. This is a stretching inside your body. Another thing, glutes and your calves again. 15 to 20 seconds, hold. Inhale and exhale, straight back. And release, back to position. Now bring that leg, lower leg, towards your back. Press it on your glutes. 
and extend your arms for body balance. Now push your hip in, suck in your belly, and you can feel the quad. And release, bring it down. Now open your uh, one arm, bring it right over your shoulder, bend your elbows towards your back, grab the elbow and press it behind you. Inhale and exhale, well done guys. And open it up, release. Now bring that arms across your neck. Flex your elbow, press the elbow. You are stretching the part of the tricep and part of the deltoids and as well as your lats. Inhale and exhale, you remember it is 15 to 20 seconds. Hold that muscle for stretching. The last part is cross your legs on one of your legs and drop, sit on your supporting leg. Extend, this is the glutes that we are targeting. And release, back straight, that is excellent. Now, that is what? You have to do after you warm up your body for 10 minutes. Stretching is important. We're going now to our main workout. Now, we've done the warm up and the stretching. After that, we have to have at least 30 seconds rest. By doing that, you walk around and grab your water. Step touch. Good. Now we will combine this with a squat right now. In. Good. Push and pull with your arms. Go. Pump. Inhale. And exhale. Four. Three. Two. One. And touch. 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 Now with this touching, we're doing the side lunges. Side lunges. And combination. Push. Twist. Twist. Cool. Now it's squat. Nearly there. Slow down. This is the surprise I'm telling you guys. And knee high. Twist. Challenge your heart rate. Your muscles. Keep going. Now march on the spot. Now toe touch. Twist and push. Down. Now, guys, we've done the main workout. What we're doing now is part of cooling down by just squatting, slow down. Now, step touch here, step touch. Slow down. This is the cool down period. Now ready for your stretching. After 10 minutes of that cool down, like what we did, one leg to the front, like what we did on the warm up. We targeted the lower part of the body. So the hamstring, the calves, and the butt. And release back to position. And one leg to the side and launch on your supporting legs inside of your leg hamstring butt again calves inhale and exhale bring that right leg working leg behind the supporting legs bring one arm up grab the wrist and pull it opposite side of the body and release guys open your arms Bring it to the front on your shoulder level and push. 
and this is a stretching on your lower back, upper back, and also your lower back, mid back, and this is excellent. Suck that in, push your hip in, drop your shoulder down, and push. That is the proper way of doing a total back stretching. And open it up, chest out, bring your arms towards your back, and stretch your chest. Inhale is important, and exhale. Keep breathing. Now one arm over. We're going to stretch the tricep. So push that elbow behind your back. And release, guys, across your neck. Elbow press towards your body. And what we are doing here is we are stretching the deltoid, the tricep. And that is all the whole part of the body that you have stretched. And I wish you guys are having fun to, stretch, to work out with us. We have more fun when you keep watching Healthy Living with Mila. Wow, Mila, that is a great workout. Oh, I loved it. Oh my, can you feel we are still gasping for breath? <laughs> yeah, At and least. you're sweating and well, breathing, for, taking that's your breath. That's the main important. I sweat, we sweat, and our heart rate is really like pumping up. And that is what we want to read. So we know that we are producing the good result in the yes. long run. Well, Mila, I think you need energy. Why not I to try Queen Emma? Thank you so much for bringing it. This is the time that we need it badly to replenish the energy that we just burned now. The six grams, I want to show you guys what the six grams is. That is just enough. After you do the exercise and you exert a lot of effort, the six gram is that part there. I am going to cut it that's a six grams six grams that is just enough for you to take to replenish what you have spent for 30 to 40 minutes of intensity exercise this is exactly the first four weeks of our uh, fitness program that targets your heart and your lung and now you can see they're sweating their muscles are really burning, they're catching their breath. For the viewers challenge, send in a recent photograph of yourself of what you look like today. Again, I stress, please do not cheat. So, with your, included in the picture is your contact detail, your name in full, and where you're living. Send it to us, to the address on MTV as shown on the screen. We will then send you a form for you to fill out and help you to work out to achieve your ideal weight. So, Please take part in this viewers challenge. You will enjoy it. And this is about for this week. We'll see you next week. Goodbye. Bye. Healthy Living with Mila, proudly sponsored by Paradise Beverages, TST Barocco, and Trophy House, and proudly supported by Laguna Hotel. <laughs>